Hi Scorpio, this is Wendy from Wendy's Tarot. Welcome to my channel. In this video, we're going to be spying on your person. We're going to take a look at how does your person secretly feel about you and how does your person secretly see you. All right, let's go ahead and get started. Just as a reminder, this is a general reading. It might not resonate with everyone, but if it resonates with you, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. If you haven't already, I'd really appreciate it. All right, let's see. How does your person secretly feel about you, Scorpio? All right, Scorpio, first card is the Two of Wands in reverse, the Queen of Swords in reverse, the Nine of Cups in reverse, Ten of Swords, Four of Wands, Queen of Wands. At the bottom, we have the Fool in reverse. You might be dealing with an Aries for some of you, also a Sagittarius or a Leo for some of you. Gemini, Aquarius, or Libra. Alright, let's see. How does this person secretly feel about you? Scorpio, I feel like this person is kind of um, ending things with you here. I feel like they're turning their back to you. There is an energy of spitefulness here with this person. Could be vindictiveness. Could be kind of just somebody who's... You know, the B word. <laughs> I don't want to... I don't want to say a bad word on... Um, in the video, but you know what I mean. Because we do have th this combination here of the Queen of Swords in reverse and the Queen of Wands. Which is kind of someone usually who has an attitude, you know. Someone who has an attitude problem. Someone who has an ego problem. Yeah, someone who's upset, angry. And, you know, being a little spiteful here. Is what I'm seeing. It's almost like something didn't go their way. Or it's like things didn't go according to their plans or to things didn't meet their expectations or their rules. This can be a very strict person or someone just who has very, you know, high standards and strict rules and flexible. I feel like they're ending things with you here. Let me see what they're doing, actually. Tell me more. Uh, let me see what else they're doing. Tell me about the Queen of Wands spirit. The Four of Cups in reverse. And the Page of... Yeah, and the Page of Swords in reverse. I was feeling this energy. I feel like they're ending things with you, but at the same time, they're spying on you, which is strange. Because it seems like they're they're acting here like they're over you and like they're pissed off or like they're not happy with something and they're ending things. But at the same time, they're looking at you, watching you, spying on you. Kind of waiting to see how you'll react, you know. They're curious about how, how you'll react. Okay, so what are this person's intentions and desires with Scorpio? Let's take a look at what are their secret intentions and desires with you, Scorpio.
Okay, let's take a look. What are their secret intentions and desires? First card is the Justice card in reverse, the Hierophant in reverse, the Ace of Pentacles in reverse, the Three of Swords in reverse, the Death card, and the Four of Wands in reverse. Yeah, it looks like this person wants to end things with you. They don't want to they don't want to commit to you. They don't want to settle down. They don't want to have a relationship. They just want to end things. So why the page of swords though? Let's clarify the page of swords, spirit. The 6 of wands, okay? And the Ten of Swords. So they're spying on you for no reason. They're spying on you just to see how you will react. To see if you will chase them or not. Just for their own ego, it, apparently. With the Six of Wands here, it's just to feed their own ego. Just to, you know... Like it gives them some sort of satisfaction to know that to know that you you'll still be chasing after them. It's like they want you to chase they want you to chase them, but for no reason. It's not like they plan on on coming back to you on returning back to you. I feel like they already have it set in their mind that. They don't want to continue in a connection or relationship with you. They have it already set that they want to end things with you. So at this point, they're just kind of sticking around just to, just for their ego, just, just to inflate their ego to see if you chase them or not. Well, hmm. arrogant, right? Very arrogant energy. Obviously, this person is pissed off. They're carrying some sort of grudge they have a chip on their shoulder for some reason but yeah that's that's what i see there scorpio how does this person see you let's take a look at that what is their view of you what is their perspective of you Okay, let's see first card we have in regards to how they see you or how they view you we have the world card in reverse they think you still want something with them the three of wands in reverse the eight of cups in reverse yeah they think you still want want them back five of swords in reverse king of cups in reverse high priestess yeah that's that's the message there they think that you want to have a reconciliation with them. They think you want to have a second chance with them. That you want them back. That you still have feelings for them. That you still have a, have an attachment to them. But from what I can see in their energy, they don't feel the same way. Scorpio, they feel this is someone who... You know, who's very kind of greedy or arrogant in their energy. Um... And they feel like the relationship has, or the connection, whatever it is that you two had, has served its has served its purpose. And they they feel like the way they're coming across in the cards, it's like they don't have a need for this connection anymore. And it looks like they're just kind of walking away and ending things, and it like. We have the Six of Wands, so they're, like I said, they're doing it in a kind of spiteful way. Or vindictive also. Kind of a vindictive energy. Well, okay, Scorpio, so I'm sorry this was negative, but I hope this was able to give you some form of clarity. 
um, and guidance in some way. Um, if this reading resonated, please give me a thumbs up. I really appreciate that. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye Scorpio. Take care.